Hi, I'm Connor down at Peggy Canans, and today we're going to talk about our craft beer bottle selection. First off, we're going to talk about our Breckenridge Oatmeal Stout. And here we have the Breckenridge Oatmeal Stout. It has flavors of dark roasted coffee and espresso, along with some chocolate flavors. The alcohol by volume is a 4.9% alcohol. And now we have our Breckenridge Vanilla Porter. The Breckenridge Vanilla Porter is an ale that has all the chocolate and roasted nut flavor of a classic porter. Only difference is it's made with actual real vanilla beans. Alcohol by volume, 4.7%. And next up from New Holland Brewing Company is Dragon's Milk. Dragon's Milk is a complex, barrel-aged strong ale with a soft, rich caramel malt character intermingled with deep vanilla tones. It goes great with red meat, rich cheese, and dark chocolate. Alcohol by volume is about 9%. And another New Holland beer, our Mad Hatter. The Mad Hatter is classified as an India pale ale as opposed to an Indian pale ale. It's got dry hopping, provides a distinctive and floral hop aroma, while the lively and hoppy body is a subtle balance with delicious malt notes. It's got an alcohol by volume of 5.8%. And here we have Parat. Parat is a triple by strength and an IPA by history. It's re-fermented twice, once in the bottle and once in the keg. It's got an alcohol content of 10.5%. And next up, we have our Great Lakes Brewing Company, Edmund Fitzgerald. Uh, the Great Lakes Edmund Fitzgerald is a complex roasty porter with a bittersweet chocolate coffee taste and a bold hop presence. Named after the ship, that sunk off the coast of Lake Superior on November 10th. It's got an alcohol content of 5.8%. And another Great Lakes product is the Elliott Ness. Great Lakes Elliott Ness is an amber lager with rich, fragrant malt flavors balanced with crisp, noble hops. Named after Prohibition era's most respected safety director, Elliott Ness, who was charged with taking down Al Capone. Once again, I'm Connor here at Peggy's. That was our craft beer in bottle selection. Thank you for watching. <laughs>